Yo guys, what up, the Blue Gangster here, and I'm gonna show you how I figured out how to uh, defeat Akuma on Ultra Hard. I know I can't, could do that in German as well, but as you follow my tutorial videos, you should know what I mean, even if I talk in English, okay? So first thing, this is a very important thing. Every time he attacks with his uh, fireballs, you have to close up the range. You have to be there so you can punish him. That's an important thing. Thing and the best thing to do that is an electric because then you can do a full combo, okay? So, and then there is this one plus two, he can't charge up. If he does that, you have to duck immediately because if you don't duck immediately, he gonna fuck you up for real. Uh, in the other hand, if you do that too early, he's gonna cancel that attack and he's gonna do something different, and then you in his combo and you're done. And what I'm doing right here, if I do my combo, wait a second. Yeah, you just have to, yeah, look. You have to duck, then you do a combo, and you don't fly with him. You don't do that flying TGF, because if you do this, there will be almost no range, like zero range. And then he can punish you, like, however he wants to, right? So you don't do that. You do a simple combo and a laser. Usually you don't use that, but in that type of situation, it's very good. Because he gets that extra damage and you see, I try to punish him like that because I thought it's almost over, but that's not the case. You always have to stay on defense, always on defense, always spacing, backdashing, ducking, and I'm not good with that low thing. You see, I, I was too hyped, that was like fuck, 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 you see. So what you're gonna do, if you, if you can do this, like blocking his lows, then you do a 2-2 two, two for a combo and you do a health sweep into one uh, follow-up, right? And that's basically it. You keep your range, you don't go like uh, at this range and wait a second. If he does this, wait till it, the range is almost zero. If it is like this, then do your rage out. Because if you do it while he's like, while the range is something like this or even more, you're gonna lose. No matter how much life you still got even if you want to do a perfect if you fuck this up you lose okay so the thing wait a second let me repeat that shit so important things if he does this fireballs and he's always doing stance going back and then he does these fireballs you try to run there or wave dash there to punish him right after the third one just like you saw here I tried a double electric combo because it worked before but it ain't working here as you can see and that was pretty fucked up I fucked up like a lot of times but in the end I still could get it done and you see if you keep that range if you keep that range you don't go like like this so he can punish you and you do a laser he's automatically going with it because he's uh, tack rolling to the left and sidestep into the right or the other way and he's going to get hit by that laser you see, and if I do this, he could, like, punish me to freak out. This actually could already be over. I was so lucky at that point. And you see, I was so hyped that I fucked this shit up. If you duck him while he's doing the low and you parry him, low parry him, do a 2-2 two, two into health sweep 1, and then don't even wait. Do a laser immediately after that so it connects. No matter which way it's going, it's always going to connect just like this. And you have to wait because this 1 plus 2 he's doing, this is a kind of a charge up. So if this hits, you're almost done. You always have to wait to block and then to punish. And if he does this 1 plus 2 shit, just simply duck and do a 1-2 punish into a freaking combo. But still keep that range, still keep that distance so that laser's gonna connect. Because this is a shit ton of damage to that guy. You see, and it even doesn't matter. Because if he going back doing that fireballs, he's always regain some life but if you keep doing that in that way it doesn't matter sometimes you're gonna get it maybe it will take way more time but if you keep doing that waiting spacing backdashing and then punishing and not going into it and try to attack and do some crazy stuff it's gonna work and you have to get that timing you can't do that like in the first try well you can if you're a pro player if you're better than me but if you're like a beginner or a green rank or whatever, then don't, don't like, how should I put this? Don't expect too much, alright? 
you just have to go through all that timing and all of that stuff and then you'll actually get it you know when to duck you know when to parry you know when to like just wait to punish and all of that type of stuff and it will be good there's nothing more to it it depends on your timing it depends on your timing and you can't get the timing like on the first try so you will just wait you will just wait you just do it over and over and over again and sometimes it's like muscle memory on the controller if you keep doing that you'll actually get it and then you know what to do so let me rewind all of the all of the like important parts if he does the fireballs go there do a sidewalk and sidestep go there and punish him right after if you can't see that this range ain't gonna be good enough to punish him don't do it stay on block stay safe stay on that range if he does his one plus two charge up if he does his one plus two charge up wait a second duck and then punish with one two because if you go and do that too early he's gonna cancel it and you go and get comboed and it's done as i said i was very lucky and many times when he's when he's doing like that diving kick the follow-up is gonna be a low or if he just does this uh, one one i think it is he's gonna do it after that a low, uh, uh, a low so if he does that that one one you can easily punish him with a one two I know that's not a lot of damage but it keeps him from doing some crazy stuff okay and if you pun in if you block and you go low you punish him with one two you do a combo you watch out that the range is good enough that you keep that spacing and distance and you do a laser because he's going to get automatically in it and that's basically it you have to watch your movement your spacing your timing and you have to have good punish good blocks and that's it because this took me about two to three minutes but if i would have done it like exactly like i should have with the possibilities i had in this video i could have it done in like one to two minutes not even two minutes like one and a half or just one minute and you can't do that too because I'm just a fucking green brag, alright? And that's basically it. Thank y'all for watching. I hope you could get something out of that. And if there's still some questions, just ask right away, alright? The Blue Gangs is out. We see us again because I'm gonna do some crazy stuff in Tekken. And that's it. Hope you liked it. Word YouTube.